Welcome back. In today's new notebook, we have a special guest here, Kelly Pitts. She's with us today, and Kelly is on the board for Lubbock Meals on Wheels. Has an important event to share with us. Happening in the month of September, I might add. Right. So that's just around the corner. Welcome to New Notebook. We're so glad to have you, you here. Um, tell us a little bit about Feed Seniors Now. That's the name of the event, correct? Yes, that's okay. the name of the event. Comfort Keepers actually started this 13 years ago, and I was working with them at the time. And it is an initiative that benefits the Lubbock Meals on Wheels recipients of the weekend meal bags. So normally, Meals on Wheels delivers about 850 to 900 hot meals wow. Monday through Friday. And then on Friday, they also deliver a weekend meal bag that is filled with a few items like peanut butter crackers and yeah. beanie weenies, individual little items Single like serve that. Items. Single serve items uh -huh, that are non-refrigerated. And that's what we collect throughout the month of September during our program called Feed Seniors Now. Okay. And that's delivered to about 550 people each Friday. And that's for the weekend. Because the they weekend. might not have somebody there that can exactly. help them during that time of uh, the week. Uh, so how much goes into this? I know that takes a lot of groceries. That takes a lot of non perishable single serve items. Absolutely. And, and and how many people volunteered to put this together? A lot of work. We have it is a lot of work, but it's it's a lot of fun. We have a lot of businesses who actually go to the they'll help with Walmart, they'll sure. help we have a Walmart day on October seventh that we will be collecting. Okay. But all throughout the month of September, we welcome any business, any organization, any church group, Sunday school group to do their own food and funds drive to benefit this program. So they can collect those specific eight items that we're looking for this year. Yeah. And bring as many of them as they want to to Meals on Wheels. What a great service project yes. right there. It's you could do for FCA that. groups could do something like this. Church groups yes. like you mentioned, businesses or other organizations. Um, and when they come together, they can help with funds and with food. Absolutely. Because funds last all year long. Okay, absolutely. <laughs> we did have a problem. Uh, last year we had so many items that it was difficult for storage because that's why we've kind of limited the number of items okay. and we're getting more protein in the items so that we don't have boxes and boxes of chips that are full of air. Right. You know? So okay. we're trying to narrow it down so that we have enough storage room because it was... Absolutely. And there's the nitty gritty right yeah. there. Everything you need to know. It's Feed Seniors Now Month. And this is where you can be part of it all by donating um, those perishable single serve food items at area Walmart locations. That's from 10 a.m. to 7 p.m. daily. These food items will be used for weekend meal bags delivered to folks with no one to help them on the weekends, just like Kelly mentioned. And it's September 1st through the 30th. All month long, you can be part of this and give back to those that really just need this, um, not just during the week, but on the weekend. It's so important. Kelly, right. thank you for being here. Thank you. you can find all the details at kcbd.com, but don't go away. The second half hour of News Channel 11 at noon will return after the break.